Welcome back to another episode of, oh, this painting is not what I really want, so I'm going to have to paint over it. I painted this uh, a couple months ago, and it's awesome. I'm going to say a bunch of things I love about it, and then I'm going to tell you why we're moving on. But first of all, the reds, they all push you up. I think that's fun. Second of all, I'd say the blues. They pull you down and they take more of this area. There's almost no red up there. There's little pops, but barely. And I feel like that keeps bringing your eye up. And the yellow, again, just the motion of it is really cool. I think the use of empty space is pretty awesome too. All in all, I think it's a pretty cool painting. But, I don't love it. Right off the bat, I just wanted to have the color scheme put down. So these greens, yellows, and blues are what we're gonna have for the rest of the painting. And then I put down this dark spot just to have something to focus my eyes on and play around. So as I started to put paint down, I really try to make it to where your eye bounces left to right, right to left, and back and forth. I think that these long canvases are pretty fun. And if you kind of place colors in a way where it's across, the painting but not in a way where it's like symmetrical because that's that would be the worst I mean not the worst but that's not personally what I want to do um, but as these colors start to come around I start to throw on these whites with this drippy pattern and I love the way the drips look so I had to let the drips dry before I put down more coats and there's a little bit of bubble wrap usage <laughs> and just to create some texture and then I end up Throwing down a little bit more of the blues that we saw earlier and a little bit more of the greens. I think these final colors that I mixed are absolutely gorgeous. And all in all, I think the blacks really tie this piece together. And I just think like these drips are so fun. I think this blue mark is absolutely gorgeous. I love the way it transitions into this green. I think that the white drips play with the black drips and it just pulls you across and back. I have this circular black guy going on, and then deeper within the painting over here, there's a circular white guy going on, and then it just pulls you back. So, all in all, I gotta say, like the yellows, the greens, the blues, the dark greens, whew, I think it's absolutely gorgeous. So, as always, appreciate you coming by, and I hope you have a good day.